Hello everyone out there in YouTube land, my name is William Armstrong with AllPlatformGaming.com and welcome to my backlog. For those of you who don't know what a backlog is, it's that list of games that for whether for one reason or another, past or present, you just didn't have time to get to. And as a huge David Cage fan, whenever I tell people that I have never played Indigo Prophecy, I get that look. You know the look I'm talking about, viewers. The look where... It, it, it's a cult classic. I understand. I just never had time to go back. But as soon as I heard they released the remastered edition on Steam, it, it's time. It, it's time to play Fahrenheit. The kids are in bed. Coffee is hot. I promise not to drink it in your ear. And I am finally going to play Fahrenheit Indigo Prophecy Remastered. Oh gosh, already? No. New game. Being a big David Cage fan, I'd say I'd probably play through Heavy Rain maybe once every other year. So I guess this is going to take up my Heavy Rain time. I can be forgiven for that. I hope. Things are never quite what they seem. I'm so excited. We understand the world around us, but... We really only see the outside, what it seems to be. Very poetic. I used to be just like you. I believed in humanity. You had a backlog too? Soap commercials, politics, and history books. Did he say soap commercials? the world kicks you in the teeth. And you don't have any choice but to see things the way they really are. My name is Lucas Kane. My story is the one where an ordinary guy has something extraordinary happen to him. Maybe it was supposed to happen. Maybe it was my destiny or my karma or whatever. I know one thing for sure. Nothing's ever going to be the same again. He looked pretty bandaged up there. Oh, I am so excited. Far-hearted. Heat. Fahrenheit. Not Celsius, so I guess it's in America. It all started right here. Where else could it happen? New York, capital of the universe. The chessboard Destiny chose for the last big game. I was just another pawn living my pawn's life. Until that night, when my life descended into chaos. You remember back in the day, viewers, when it used to be... They used to tell you how many particle effects and how many pieces of rain they can get into one shot? I'm gonna have to pause the video and count the snow particles right now. Maybe later. That's a bird. All right. Starting off with adolescent humor already. 10 of 10. Would recommend. That guy has an exceptionally large bladder. Ooh, knife. Where did the knife and the blood come from in the first place? I've heard this game gets kind of weird. So, buckle up. It's the Undertaker. Photo negative. Okay, if I was washing my hands and I saw that in the mirror behind me, I'd probably freak out. This guy seems pretty okay with it. Oh, well, except... Then that happens. 
Oh man, he was just going to the bathroom. So there's not really any mystery on who the killer is. I'm pretty sure it's that guy. Alright. Really not fighting back. Just let it happen. The turtleneck killer. <laughs> Remember when I said the kids were asleep and the coffee's made? That little girl just scared the piss out of me. No, whatever you are, I don't want to come to you. Fugue State. Which is a thing now since Breaking Bad's over. Done? I got minus 60 depressed already. Bum, bum, quick. Bum, bum. I, I've, I've got to get out of here before somebody comes in here. I'm the icon in the upper hand corners and the progress on my place save in the hard drive. Well, thank you. Uh, better wash this. Alright, here's the part where I learn how to play. Probably really shouldn't be playing keyboard and mouse, but... In fact, I can probably fix that. Oh, I gotcha. That's easy. Okay. <laughs> All right. Gonna do it. I I see the arrows. Ah. Uh, oh my! I gotcha. I gotcha. Uh, I want to drink orange juice so bad. <laughs> we're going to get there, guys. It took me a second to realize what we were doing. Oh, I can do it faster. I thought I was... Am I going to flush him down the toilet? Oh, my gosh. Video game IQ just went in the tank. Let's wash out of order. Oh. <laughs> yeah, just like the sign says. Out of order. Come on. Do not do this to me. Do I gotta look at myself in the mirror? I'm covered in blood. I can't go anywhere looking like this. Okay, I really want to get to this one. Out of order. Apparently not. Oh, swipe to the right for right sink. Gotcha. Wash it off that turtleneck, buddy. Oh, now I'm only anxious. Bum, bum, bum. Trash can. Got anything for me? If I had to guess, I would say that... Not just because someone was horribly murdered in there, but that doesn't look like the cleanest bathroom in the world. The knife. I've got to get rid of it. Probably should mop up that blood, too. Oh, of course. This is really working out. What did he do with the knife? Let me look at that window. It's barred up. I can't get out this way. Jeezy Pete's, that guy is coming this way. I think I'm busted. There is a lot of blood on the floor. <laughs> Welcome to my backlog where I fail in the first five minutes. Gotcha. 
And that's how my story ends. <laughs> I'm spending the rest of my days rotting in some prison somewhere. Uh, exactly what whoops. All right. Backlog fail, number one. Now that we've got that one out of the way, we're going to figure it out. Uh, I saw a mop. Maybe I could mop up the blood. Or maybe I just need to get out of there faster. I don't know. We're going to find out. Let's try that one more time. Look what I can do. Much faster. Okay. Okay, what happens if I go over? Still got the same amount, but I'm wondering if I've got more time now before the police officer comes in. Let me walk backwards. Okay. I'm covered in blood. I can't go anywhere looking like this. Gotcha. We're gonna wash off. We're gonna hide the knife. Whoops. Knife. Knife. The knife. Okay. I've got to get rid of it. Okay, last time this is where we saw the police officer. Okay. Ah! Uh, uh. So is that what triggers it? Can I not mop up the blood? Get it quick. Get it, get it. <laughs> nope. Uh, I'm just... I'm getting out of there. Ooh, shift button. Dadgum and I tried. Don't want to talk to nobody. Don't want to order nothing. We are getting out of there. Sir. The waitress. She noticed something. I better go kill her. Oh, yes. I had a time limit. Forgot to pay your tab? I think that you might have forgotten to pay your bill. Oh, yes, oh. Of course I, excuse me. The bill for the meal. How could I forget that? Uh, because I haven't played Some this game before. Fight. What does that look like? Kidneys and... Okay. Yeah, pay it. Yeah, pay in cash. Do not use your credit card after you just murdered somebody in the bathroom. I hope you left a good tip. I wonder if I'd have been able to do that. I need to get out of this neighborhood before the police get here. Let's run towards the camera. Always going for it. Get out of there. I live too far away to walk. I have to find another way to get back home. Uh run? Stamina gauge. That guy is totally coming after me if I do not run. Cab. Oh, you're kidding me. All right. <laughs> Who is the origami killer? Okay, so far. He's going. Cab. Cab. A crime has just been committed. Hail that cab. Whew. I am stressed. Too bad I'm gone. So I'm totally the killer. There's no ifs, ands, or buts about it. I watched me do the killing. No mystery here. David Cage and his homeless people. Good grief. Okay. Doesn't have snow tires. That's it. Why do they always wait for me to go on duty before they start killing each other in the middle of the night? Tyler, somebody gets murdered every day in New York. Really? Especially when I'm on night duty. It's as if every psycho in the city has it in for me. <laughs> Is that you supposed to be a decal? Inside. That way I don't have to freeze to death listening to it. Well, don't lean in the snow. You're the boss, 
12 inches of snow. In five years on the forest, I've seen some murders. But you never really get used to death. You just learn to live with it, that's all. I still don't know if it was fatigue or cold or something else. But I clearly remember the bad feeling I got when I walked into that restaurant. Oh, going a little noir style. Okay. I like it. I like how there was like a noir retrospect button. Uh-oh. Blood. Blood. I see it now. And it's clipping through my boot. How's it going, McCarthy? Evening, Inspector. I've been waiting for you. Hey, Tyler. Hey, Martin. So, what happened? Homicide. I found the body in the toilets. I had to go before I went home. <laughs> Cops and their jokes. Did anybody notice anything strange? No, nobody saw anything. Of course. Do we have a suspect? A client left just before I found the body. Uh, he had the Who worst the turtleneck. His name was uh, John Winston, a regular here at the restaurant. Kate knew him. She could tell you more. Oh, poor Kate. Which table was the suspect sitting at? Oh, he was sitting at that. He's table already the there. suspect. Jeez. Does he like kidneys? What were you doing here? Were you on duty? I wasn't. I just happened to be here when the murder happened. I like to come by here after work. Kate's coffee is the best in the East End. Now, does is he like to come here after he goes to work? Or did yeah, he have to go to the Kate bathroom before he went home? He was on duty. I think that you should interrogate mm. him. If you don't mind me saying. You don't, don't fool me, McCarthy. She's still in a state of shock. Thanks for your help, Martin. It's late. I think you can go home and get some sleep. I'm going to wait until you're finished with Kate, if you don't mind. I want to make sure she gets home okay. Bum, bum, bum. Switch characters. Let's switch characters. Back then, we didn't know anything. Retrospect we button. We just thought it was cold, you know? If I had known, I probably would have stayed in bed that night. Not gotten out till it was all over. That's the problem. If we knew ahead of time what was going to happen, Mm -hmm. the house. Well, that's that's deep. That's deep right there, buddy. Why does he touch his back pockets every time he walks? Pretty funny seeing you on the job at this hour, Tyler. What, you fall out of bed? Yeah, don't make me laugh, uh -huh. Gary. My lips are chapped. <laughs> you look hammered, Tyler. Yeah, this is my third night on call in a row. You know me, man. If I, don't I wonder if they're from the scientific department. City. Uh, you should be out of here pretty soon, though. No, 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 Carla. She's capable of keeping everybody up till breakfast. And she is by far mm. the most stubborn girl I ever met. Breakfast. Uh, I don't want him to talk to Kate. I want her to talk to Kate. On my way, tell her. Kate? I'm Inspector Carla Valenti. I'm in charge of the investigation here. Would you mind answering a few questions? Her face is kind no. of scary. Go ahead. It's like they forgot a few textures. Have you been working here long, Kate? It'll be 11 years next month. I've it's a long time to work at a diner. Place, down and out as junkies, you name it. The till's been robbed a few times, but murder? That's a new one. I kind of feel like I am playing L.A. Noir, like I'm grilling her. Can you tell me anything about the customer who left just before they discovered the body? Ugly turtleneck. He's just a normal guy. I didn't really pay any attention to it. What was he like, Kate? Come on, turtleneck. You, you could describe him for me? Turtleneck. I only saw him for a few seconds. I guess he was about average height, fairly young. That's all I can remember. Wow, they're really honing in on him. Could anyone else have come in? No, I don't think so. You can only get in the front door. If somebody else had come in, I would have seen them. What? what? Was John here alone? Yes. Did he speak with anyone? John always came alone. We chatted a bit. The weather, his job, usual stuff. He never talked to anybody else. So he's a loner. Did you get the impression that John and the suspect knew each other? 
Stop bobbing your head no. when you talk. I don't think they did know each other. The What's Tyler doing in the background there? When John came in. He's tweeting they it. Didn't talk to each other. Hashtag no, I, tired. I'm that John didn't know him. Facts. Can Facts. you tell me what you saw? There weren't that many people in my It's usually pretty calm during the week. I was just chatting with Martin at the bar. I didn't even see John get up. Oh my god. Poor girl. You have to cheer up. John Kane. I know that this has been a shock for you, but you're the only one who can help us find the suspect. No pressure. <laughs> my shift was almost over. I was just chatting with Martin at the bar. John got up and went to the restroom. Oh, and she's she's laying it out. There you out, go. I noticed that he hadn't paid his bill. I'm careful because that happens a lot here. People forgetting to pay their bills. Yeah, quote what unquote. The man came back. He paid his bill and left. It wasn't until Martin found John's body that I realized. Did you hear anything while John was in the toilets? The sound of a struggle or yelling? A no, bird, I didn't notice anything. flashing candles, druidic sacrifice. Did you happen to notice anything strange about John tonight? Did he seem worried or stressed out? No. He drank a lot, so he had to go to the like bathroom. He always is. He even made a joke when he came in. Do you think that you would recognize the suspect? I'll never forget that face. Oh, Perfect. okay. Do you think that you could come down to the station tomorrow? What joke did John tell when he first came in? The killer? Yeah. I'll do whatever you think I can to help catch him. Thank you very much for your help. Kate. She's wearing a turtleneck too, I just noticed. I hope you find the bastard who did it. People like that just don't deserve to live. I promise you, we'll do everything in our power to find him. Go home now and try to get some sleep. Martin will make sure you get home okay. So it appears that there are ends to the dialogue trees. And as I go through it, I come to maybe a desirable, maybe an undesirable outcome. I don't know. Good night. Why is the scientific department here? Mm, we're gonna go to the bathroom. Hmm. Here's his fork. But where's the knife? Oh. XOXO. Well, well, the coffee's not on the bill. Weird. So whose coffee was it? A cup of coffee and a soft drink? That's weird. He's a caffeine addict. Or else he wasn't alone. Did she see anybody else? Oh, maybe I should have come here first. A book. The Tempest by Shakespeare. This is his. It's a pretty weird book for a killer to be reading. If I was more cultured, I'd probably Gary, know there's a book under right this off table. the bat. Why don't you check it out for if friends? that was good or bad. You got it, Carla. I've never read Tempest by Shakespeare. Totally not switching to Tyler. You know, who are you going to call? Frank, can you verify all of the calls that came through this phone tonight? You got it, Carla. Man, she's only tense. Oops. Tyler, I'm gonna take a look outside. Why would you take a look outside before you took a look in the bathroom? <laughs> opens from the inside. Is that why is the Yeah. I'm minus tending myself. Good evening, sir. Whoa. <laughs> hey. <laughs> Look at the textures on her lips. Remastered. You know, uh, you really shouldn't be outside tonight. It's freezing cold. If you want, I could have him come and pick you up and... Oh, leave me alone. I'm just fine. Gotcha. My name is Carla Valenti. And you? Valenti. I'm not going to remember that. <laughs> Nobody uses it anymore. Guess mm -hmm. I just forgot it. <laughs> they call me the lazy eye. But my friends call me Bogart. 
Poker. <laughs> okay. Because I look so much like that actor. Come on. Okay. Oh, that, that seemed to I'm please her go. a little bit. Try to get you gotta go? What? No. Take care of yourself. Yeah. Oh, I totally bombed that, guys. <laughs> Is he gonna talk to me? Oh, fail. Well, we're playing it through, though. I failed. Did we see anybody run the wrong way down the street a couple times before we finally got in the cab? Man, I failed at that. So, I am playing the killer and the person trying to catch the killer. This is so confusing. I want to go in the bathroom. There we go. Did it say men and women's? Pool of blood. This is where I killed him. Gotcha. Bum, bum, bum. Several wounds on the left side of the chest, mm -hmm. in the area of the heart. They appear to be knife wounds. The glasses are staying on there really good. Why right. Is blood here? Hey, that was my question. Possibly. I don't understand why there would be blood here. Maybe it belongs to the victim. Not likely. Get Garrett to analyze it. Then we'll know for sure. <laughs> what is she looking at? Okay. That stall is not part of the game. This is where I found the knife. No trace of a struggle. Did Looks I dispose like the of the knife in the trash can? Surprise. You always check the trash cans. Come on. Is he still tweeting? Hashtag bored. Okay. I really feel like I'm going to miss something. But what are you going to do? Nope. Does he notice anything different? thinking what I'm thinking? No, why don't you tell me? In the stall. The killer dragged the body Whoops. I <laughs> got a little, you know little bit of clipping. Not as far as I know. Oh, right. Bizarre. What? Bizarre. Well, he still has his credit card and a hundred bucks in cash on him. I guess the killer wasn't after his money. So he does notice different things. Okay. Ah, check the trash can. Yes, that's what I'm talking about. Just what exactly are you doing, Tyler? Being a good police officer. What do you think? He's watched CSI once or twice. Wash your hands after digging through garbage, everybody. Hey, there's some blood in the sink. Maybe the killer washed up before he left. Yeah, could be. <laughs> uh, I love that button. Okay. Whoa. Tyler. <laughs> what a jerk. This is a restroom, isn't it? No. I did that. Crime scene. It's cool. I'm done. Must be all that coffee I've been drinking to try and stay awake. Sounds pretty average. Oh, I... Ah, uh, whoops. <laughs> what happens if it gets all the way to the bottom? All right, Tyler's going to talk. go talk to Bogart. Hey, Carlin. I'm going to take a look outside, see if I can find anything. Yeah, there's a guy out there who's probably got some information. Yo. What are you? I was wondering, you didn't happen to see anything unusual tonight, did you? Ah, oh, leave me alone. I got nothing to say. I don't talk to cops. <laughs> oh. Thank you. You've been helpful. 
Well, that was a dead end. Now you get to run around. <laughs> Is that how they teach you how to run in cop school? Come on, man. Put the knees up. Yeah, I know there's blood right there. Why will they not let me look at it? Okay, I don't know what else to do. I do not want to play music. Surprised that there's no surveillance camera. Convenient. Hey, Garrett. hey Frank, how's it going? Hey, Carla. Hey, Carla. So, you guys find anything? We took some samples here and there. We're almost finished. We were just waiting for you before we took the body away. Well, take her away, boys. No, what? No. Oh, there we go. Finally. Blood. Killer is wounded. He is. Is there a blood trail? It would actually be really funny if there's a blood trail following all of the. <laughs> the different roads I ran down that didn't have a taxi. I'm rambling. It's okay. It happens. Here's an origami crane. Mm -hmm. Okay, come on, Tyler. Let's go. Tyler's been my partner for almost a year. He grew Let's up get with some the background on Tyler. Before he decided to join the force. He's got a really stupid smile. Sometimes he's unpredictable, but he's a good guy. If a girl came up to me and she was smiling like that for Did you find anything, that long, Tyler? something's up. For that, I'd have to be able to keep my eyes open. Keep up the good work, Tyler. All right. Come let's... on, let's go, Carla. I can't even keep my eyes open anymore. I want to take another look around. We haven't found the murder weapon. It might still be around here somewhere. <sighs> Come on. If it's not in the garbage bag, then you threw it out the window. Mm hmm. Where did he throw the knife? Okie doke. Okie doke. I like how it flashed so I wouldn't know where it was. Little jerk. <laughs> That's my favorite button. Now, will she notice something different if she goes in that one? Oh, she does not have a flush button. Oh. A table knife covered in blood. Obviously the murder weapon. Good job, Carla. Killer used his silverware to stab his victim. That would seem to indicate that the murder wasn't premeditated. Tyler, there's a knife hidden here. It might be the murder weapon. Get Garrett. Make sure he checks for prints and identifies the blood on the blade. Garrett's gonna okay. be a busy guy tonight. <laughs> right back to the phone. Oops. Or maybe not. Yeah, whoops. We'll call it whoops. Can we leave now? Man, stab some dude in the toilet? You gotta be crazy. This guy took a big... <laughs> oh, he took a big what? Ah, my fault. Sorry, viewers. You ready to go, Tyler? I think I've seen everything I need to see. Are you sure? We can take another look around if you want. That's the totally opposite of what he said last yeah, time. We're good. Let's head home. Okay. Let's nope. Watch. The player it's missed something. To the car. What a tool. I'm dead tired. Let's get to that car, and we'll call it episode one. Unless something exciting happens before I get to the car. Nope. 
All right, everyone. Thanks for watching. I am so scared.